Hey babies, it's Mama T back with another one. I'm sitting here under this tree getting getting some downloads from nature. And I started wondering a lot of things that's going on about this planet. And my question is, who put the grid on this planet? Who put the borders? around the lands saying this is my country and this is your country who divided up this planet into all these little pieces of pie and got everybody fighting over it who divided the people up you know there was a time that this planet was all one color you know it seems when i mention color these days i'm getting strikes for hate speech so you know mama's smart. She know how to say things without saying things. Now if I'm being struck for what I say now, then that's bullying and harassment on your part. Because you're so privileged. You had your way for so long. That when somebody speak out against you now in these days and times, it makes your little spirit itch. And you gotta find a way to fight back and censor and shut us up and put us in our places. Mm. Well, them days is over, baby. I'm just sorry to say. But back to the borders on the planet, when we was all one, and the people that was here first was one people. Now we're divided up into all these different people, fighting over religions and gods and countries and lands and spaces and carrying these different allegiances to these flags and everybody warring and fighting over a piece of land that all belong to earth as do you what makes you feel that you so severed from this planet that you got to divide it up and divide the people and have the people warned against one another, especially the original people that was here. Babe, I went into a little restaurant the other day. Nice little restaurant and had me some ethnic food. By some people from India, it was beautiful. And they had a family business and they had their own shows playing on TV and their own food and cuisines and, you know, these people are together. You go into a Chinese restaurant and you see the same thing. They together. They won. They got their own language, their own culture, their own, their own gods, the way that they do things. You go into the Mexican restaurants, it's the same thing. You see this unity and this camaraderie against these people, with these people that's, that's very close-knit and supportive. And everybody got that. But when I look at the original people of this earth, you so scattered and disconnected from one another. So it had me wondering. Back on about the blood types. Yeah. They say, well, we all evolved from us. Well, baby, I'm beginning to think twice about that because if you all evolved from us, you would look like us. But you don't. Asians don't look like Africans. Indians don't look like Asians, even though you share the same content. continent. Is the air different in China than it is in India? Is 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 the air that you breathe because we all have a respiratory system that breathes in the oxygen on this planet so is it different that makes you appearance look different i don't believe that you evolved to look the way that you look because you got a different blood type than we do what i think is whoever came down here took our template and mixed day blood in to make you and you got your religions and your culture and your gods and you hold steadfast to that same with China somebody came down from your group and created you because you got a different blood type you might have genetically spliced from all makeup but your blood makes you different and I'm not saying this to be divisive I'm just noticing for educational purposes only but y'all close-knitting y'all together. 
But the original ones here are fighting over every God and religion that came down here for other people. And they'll kill you for that. If it's not Jesus, it's Joshua, it's Jehovah, it's Allah, it's everything from a people that came after you. And you've been warring for other people's gods ever since. Who put the borders on the planet? Who changed your tongue? Who divided you up? It made you war with each other while everybody else stays close-knit. Why is that, people? I'ma stop dividing my people. I'm not doing that no more. It's time for us to come together as one like we were originally on this planet. We the O's, honey. OGs, they call us. The original ones. That's your tribe. And from everybody spent off from you. But I don't think they evolved from us. I think they were genetically modified from us and somehow something has been blanketed over our minds and our souls and our spirits that we have no idea who we are we've been so disconnected to mama which is our planet and we're cleaving to a father that we didn't know before they got here all these other beings came here some say to hooty was the original maker of us. I don't necessarily agree, but you can find truth in all the lies and you can find a lie in all the truths. You just gotta decipher the code shit and remember what it means to you. Tap into your DNA, your Akashic records, cause it's there. Like it's in me as I sit under this tree and I'm beginning to remember and I'm beginning to question because, yes, this, women was, this planet was inhibited by women. And then where they come from, where there is a galactic group of women that travel all through the galaxies and every family. This is beyond a lot of y'all scopes. It is. And then you're going to think it's sci-fi, but this shit that they put in them sci-fi movies that turn out to be true. Women are old, baby. Especially on this planet. We was here long before the others got here. Because we are the original cedars of the planet others come and they grab from our template and they make other beings. This is why you got all these different blood types. There's a baby girl out here that go in depth about that. I don't agree with everything she say, just like nobody should agree with everything I say, but she tap on some things that make you think a little bit. I think her name is Fleur Broom. I like her. She's so crazy, but I like her though. She's dropping some things. And she taps in about the blood types. And it makes me wonder because something happened that divided the original people up, scattered us, and got us one with one another. Just because we on different continents, that don't mean we really that different. We need to start warring with the Africans, and the Africans need to start warring with the black people over here in so-called America. All right? Because we want people. People in the Caribbean, you need to stop warring with your neighbor next door because y'all all been colonized by a different group of people that speak language. Because the only reason why you speak Spanish somewhere, some of y'all, is because of the Spaniards. Some of y'all speak Patwa, Patwa, which is a combination of French and your language. French, Spaniards, English, Romans, British, they all conquered and did things and divided us up. And you still warring and over some shit they put in you. It's time for all of us to come together because once we come together on one call, honey, and them brothers get together, and all y'all got to say is, ho, oh, one time, and the earth will rumble and shake. And when the sisters get together and they tap into that native tongue, you know, we go, yeah, 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 yeah. Ooh, honey, that brain shell, them, them brain cells will splatter all over this planet. And that's what they want you to be afraid of. Your ancient power. Remember, this your planet. Reconnect to mama. You'd be amazed at what you can do. That's it, baby. That's my message under this big old tree today. Think about some of the things I said and begin to question and ask yourself why that is. And if this is banned, I want you to go follow me on YubiTube where you get the full video. Okay? I love y'all. Be good. What's wrong with the world, mama? People never lie. Wrong with the wrong with the wrong with the wrong with the.
Mama T, Sacred Tea Shop, links in bio. Love you, babies.